YouTube, it's Abigail from All About Them Hobbies, and today we are going to be making Cupcake EOS, or Cupcake EOS lip balm. You can also use this to refill your little EOS lip balms. So, let's get started. What you're going to need is some petroleum jelly or Vaseline, some sprinkles, vanilla extract, coconut oil, a little um, tea light candle, it looks like this, or one in like a metal thing, and some cotton swabs, knife, cutting board, oh, some teaspoons, it just fell, so yeah. And you're also going to need a pot and a stove and some water and a heat proof container. I have washed and cleaned my EOS container and I've popped the grate out and I've also cut around this little thing, but you can leave like the, I don't know what you call it, the actual grate in, or you can cut out the little sticks like I did. You're going to want to get your, your top, you're going to want to get the lid, and you're going to want to get a cotton swab and your, Control and jelly or Vaseline. You're going to want to get some and a cotton swab. And then you're going to want to put it inside like this. This is what makes the sprinkle stick. Just get more. Let's just make sure you have a good amount on there. Then you're going to want to get your sprinkles. You're going to want to put them in there. <laughs> don't fill it <laughs> just get enough in there and you can pour the excess out if you put a lot in there like I did and try not to make it too thick I probably made it a little thick and just wipe around top and that's it then you're going to want to get your grate and you're going to want to screw it on to the lid I know it sounds crazy but just screw it on to the lid And make sure you put it the right way instead of the wrong way, like I did. And yeah, you want to get your cutting board and knife, and you're going to want to puff out your tea light candle from the container. And then you're going to want to get the bottom, or you're going to somehow get the wick out, maybe push it or get out from the bottom. it out or at least the little metal part then you're going to want to cut it if you can't get your wick out that's okay you can just cut it around it you're just going to want to cut it into little chunks handle into little chunks you're going to want to get your heat proof container you're going to want to put them in there Little EOS cupcake 
it in the towel, so that way you have, so it's steady, it's not like wobbling around. And this is still very hot, so be careful. that you can also put that in the freezer if you want to. So uh, later I'm actually in a different place as you can tell. And I've got my lip balm and this is how the top looks. And now I'm just gonna snap it back onto the bottom. This will make the crate go to the bottom or <laughs> go on the bottom. It's kinda hard to explain. You're just gonna snap it on or like, I'm gonna try to do this. Kind of hard. Snap back on. <laughs> Make these things so hard. It also could be that I just have an old one. I think that's why it is. You can also um, if you don't have like an old one, you can just use a new one and use like the lip balm from the new one to make this to make this one so I'm just gonna snap this on I'll be right back I got I kind of actually popped the grate out from the top and this is a really old container and so I don't think it'll pop back into the bottom because it's a really old container and I've used it before to make other recipes and so I think that's why it won't go back in so I think it'll work better with the newer containers. But anyway, this is how it looks. I can't like, I love cupcakes. I love lip balm. This is like perfect. You can actually probably use like the stick rainbow sprinkles, but I think these circle ones will probably look better. I really like this. This looks awesome. So guys, that was the end of my video. I hope you give this this lip balm a try. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment your video ideas below. From Abigail, from, from Abigail and all.